deathcore bands go. Chop for a cowboy, the band known for this. And this. And a little bit of this. Greetings, Cauldron of Weird fans. Welcome back. We've got breaking metal news right now. Fantastic, fantastic stuff going on. We have the official confirmed return of Job for a Cowboy. Yes, dude. The Job for a Cowboy are back. They are back after a, I think, six-year hiatus. I think it was like 2014. Um, but we have officially confirmation from Metal Sucks that Job for a Cowboy are returning. Oh, dude. Holy shit. The band that taught me how to scream and more importantly, in this case, how to pig squeal are returning. Um, I'm a huge job for a cowboy fan. I uh, first picked them up probably in 2007. It was my, yeah, right about 2007. It was my um, freshman year of high school actually is when uh, I started listening to these guys. And um, my buddy Nick was just like, you like metal. You got to check these guys out. They're called Job for a Cowboy. I was like, okay, stupid name, but whatever. We'll, we'll give it a shot. Job for a Cowboy for a while was one of my favorite bands. And uh, I'm so happy right now. <laughs> so I saw them a few times. Uh, my senior year in uh, 2010, they did a spring tour with... Um, Gaza, Cow Decapitation, and Whitechapel. I think that show went to Scully's <laughs> so long ago. Um, I saw them at the Metal Alliance Festival with um, Devil Driver. Who else was on that tour? Three Inches of Blood was on that tour. I know that for sure. I think Dying Fetus was on that. It was either Decrepit Birth or Dying Fetus. It was one of them. But I know Devil Driver headlined it. And I know Job for a Cowboy was there. Uh, again, this was 2012, so it was a long time ago. And then I saw them at Mayhem Festival in 2013 up in Detroit. So, or Clarkston, Michigan, whatever the fucking amphitheater is. But regardless, um, they're back. They didn't tour for their 2014 release, Sun Eater. And they just kind of released it and there was a lot of um, disappointment from bands on that just like a lot of stylistic changes from job for a cowboy in that album and uh, there was a lot of backlash and then they just kind of went away they were just gone and uh, all these rumors started popping up last year that they were talking a return and um, you know, there was a lot of back and forth on whether or not that was actually the case or not, if they were really back, or if it was just bullshit rumor. Um, but no, we now have confirmation that Job for a Cowboy will be returning um, whenever, you know, we can do things like music again. Uh, their producer actually uh, told someone in an interview, I believe is what the article was saying, that they were back. Uh, he said they were supposed to be recording New Job for a Cowboy, but the apocalypse is happening and all. But, uh... Dude, this is so exciting for me. <laughs> if concert, When concerts return, if I don't get to see Job for a Cowboy next year, I'm gonna lose my mind. <laughs> just just give, me, give me the bree, man. Give me the breeze. I need it. Um... <laughs> No, this is exciting news. This is fantastic and super exciting. Um, this news broke a few hours ago. I think it was like three hours ago at this point. Um, who knows when I get this video up, but it'll be the same day. But dude, like one of the quintessential deathcore bands is returning. I swear to God, if they don't do a tour with Whitechapel, I will be so mad. Super mad. Big mad. 
But uh, please tell me what your thoughts are in the comment section below because this is something I've been waiting for personally for a long time. And um, it's very exciting. <laughs> it's very exciting. So let me know what you think in the comment section below. Um, I'm personally thrilled. And uh, hey, while you're at it, why don't you check out my vocal cover of Entombment of a Machine? That's on this channel. Why don't you go ahead and do that? Uh, um, but anyway, I just wanted to get this out really quickly because I'm super pumped about it. I fucking love Job for a Cowboy. They're fantastic. Um, the band the that taught me how to do metal screaming and pig squeals is back. Fuck yes. Job for a Cowboy 2021. Let's go, son. I'll see you next time. I'll be the same. Oh, check out our sponsors, uh, Eargasm Earplugs, and uh, follow me on Twitch, twitch.tv forward slash collagen of weird. Bye-bye.